Good afternoon and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We are here with Fred and Gaius and we're going to demonstrate the obedience commands he's learned here at school. We're going to start off by introducing the training equipment. Fred's got a standard six foot web training leash and he keeps the bulk of that leash folded neatly in his right hand which leaves his left hand free to make a correction and the only correction we give here at school is a little tug and release on the training collar and that is the second piece of equipment. Now your boy's been fitted with his very own collar. We're going to show you how to properly put that on and use it when he comes home on Tuesday. Now the first command we're going to demonstrate is healing. Healing is properly walking on the leash and the command is guy is heal. Now at this point he's got a job to do and that's to say even with Fred's left leg no forging ahead, no lagging behind, and you'll notice whenever Fred stops your dog's been trained to automatically sit and wait for the next command. Nice automatic sit. Now all of these obedience commands are designed to make your guy a better listener at home on and off the leash. Now the next command we're going to show you is the stay command. It's a hand and a voice command. Fred will use his left hand and the one word firm command to stay. Now your dog should hold this stay for eventually one minute working up to three minutes and if he makes a little mistake like getting up when he wasn't supposed to, Fred just said no, gave a little tug on that training collar and went back to that command. He should hold this until he gets another command. When Fred returns back to guys, you'll notice he's going to walk all the way around him. He should hold that command until again Fred gives him another command and Fred will heal him out of that. Anytime, you're, anytime guys makes a little mistake, whether it's getting up, not healing properly, not holding a stay or a down stay, go right back to that command and make sure he finishes it the way it's designed to. Nice automatic sit. And you can see he's very, very focused on Fred looking up. Fred gives him the stay command again. Remember, it's a firm stay. And if he gets a little distracted, now there's a lot of distractions going on around here. Dogs in the yard, birds, the tripod. But if he does get distracted, go right back to that command again. Now instead of walking around Gaius or returning to Gaius, Fred's going to show you the come command. It's Gaius come. Use that leash if you have to to kind of guide him back to you. But he's been trained to come back and sit facing you. And then they take off healing again. So that was the come command from that sit stay. We're going to recommend when Gaius comes home that you practice as much as you can with him. You can practice indoors as well as outdoors, but on these hot days you can practice right inside your home. Nice automatic sit. Again, he's looking up at his trainer, which is what we're, which, what we're always hoping for. Another nice automatic sit. We'll show you that stay command one more time. Again, indoors you can either drop the leash, extend that, that, that distance between you and your dog, increase the amount of time you have him hold this command. Fred's going to show you that come command one more time. Guy has come, you lighten the tone of your voice, Fred encourages to come back. He comes back, he sits facing Fred. Guy gets a pat on the head for praise, let him, letting him know that he's doing a good job and then they take off properly healing again. You can see Guy's tail is up. Initially, this wasn't his favorite thing in the world to do, but he's starting to come around. Another nice automatic sit. Now the difficult command um, is the down command, and we're going to show you the down from heel position. He, guys, has been a little tricky. Fred spent a lot of time working on this down command from heel position. Now if he breaks the command, you heard Fred say no. down and stay. Now this is a lot of these commands are new for guys and working and doing obedience work so we try not to lose our patience with him. We try to work through it slowly but that's your down stay from heel position. And sometimes the dogs do surprise us when they come home they do a better job for their owners. <laughs> But we've shown you Gaius' ability to heal properly on a leash, which he does very, very well. We've shown you his ability to automatically sit whenever Fred stops healing with him. We've shown you that he knows how to hold a sit-stay. He knows the come command. And we're working on that down command, as you can see. And he, he knows it. It's just a matter of whether he feels like doing it or not. But it's a little tricky. Good. 
So we know that your guy has come a long, long way. We know that you're going to be excited to see him on Tuesday. We want to thank you so much for using Nora's Dog Training Company as your personal dog trainer. Please keep us posted on Gaius's progress at home. We're always here to help. Thanks again. We'll see you Tuesday. Have a great day.